Yo, how's it going? It's Team Sports with another video. Today we're going to do with the New York Knicks having a disappointing season in the 2021 and 2022 NBA season. The Knicks haven't allowed to pick in the NBA draft the lottery and have the 42nd pick uh, in the draft. Uh, the Knicks looking, are looking to trade up or having a package deal with Donovan Mitchell. With the amazing season uh, by RJ Berry in his third season as a New York Knicks, especially after the uh, to, uh, January 6th. But uh, but we are gonna the Boston Celtics after that scoring almost averaging about almost twenty points a game. Uh but the Knicks look to build around RJ Barry, even though still has to needs to uh fix a lot of still needs to fix some some shooting and defensive capabilities. But Knicks look to Knicks look to build around RJ Barry potential to be star and hopefully a star as a New York Knicks. Julius Randall set up with NYC and the fans and uh, disappointing play of the season is unlike last year with the with the most improved player of the, of the 2020 and 2021 season then the Knicks like are looking for to end with a contract extension last summer the Knicks are looking are, are the Knicks looking to trade Julius Randle for even with the 11 pick the New York Knicks have uh, 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 interest in Jaden and Ivy and they look to trade with the Sacramento Kings uh, then your Knicks are gonna give up a lot, but I I see them not doing it. Will be be honest, it's too too much to give up for this uh rebuilding team, and we're not a uh, Jaden Ivy away from a playoffs or even Eastern Conference Finals. Mm -hmm. With the Portland Trail Blazers entering the rebuild mode, uh, the Knicks look can can look forward to move uh, Julius Randle to the Portland Trail Blazers in exchange for seven of overall pick and the thirty six pick for from Portland. And th this could be a very good trade for the Knicks, um, avoiding the Orlando contract and bringing the new power forward in and it potentially putting uh, Obi top in as, as a starter or drafting one as a backup to Obi top. If the Knicks stay at eleven and don't trade, don't don't trade up or give it up, uh, the first prospect is is a most likely pick is Ty Ty Washington from the University of Kentucky. I see this player uh, really being on the Knicks. Uh, I really I see him as uh, drafting on the Knicks as, as a really a, a point guard, a shooting guard. He's, I see him, you know, he's a great, great player. I love him. A second ultimate uh, draftee for the New York Knicks is AJ Griffin from Duke, uh, a shooting guard or a small forward. Uh, I see, I really see us, I mean, drafting him, but I don't think he's really going to be Good in the Knicks, Knicks system with Tom Thibodeau, you know, playing the veterans. Or was it 10, uh, 15 plus minutes a game? But I don't really see A.J. Griffin as like, as a really a Nick and, and not ready for, a, you know, NYC and not going to be in the system. But uh, I, we could easily draft him, but it's a potential. The third prospect I see is Mekhi Becton out of Ohio State. A really big minute uh, with the potential for Mitchell Robinson. Probably be signing or probably not. So this is a good insurance run, but Knicks could really draft, but I don't see it uh, as a high at uh, the top, the uh, top of the list. With the fourth prospect for the NBA, uh, 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 for the Knicks, um, potential list is Kai Soto. I really, uh, a player that really just jumped up in the radar. He played, even though he hasn't played in college in the U.S. this year. Uh, he hasn't played. He's from the G League. He's a very big man and. A very just a very impact scorer all around the floor and just defensively and offensively very good and I mean I I, I see next potential get this pick is very like uh, like a pick that we have a uh, we're not gonna with with the sixth prospect for the I mean uh, NBA draft uh and a high another target for the next is Oshie Bachu from Kansas well, recently a champion in March of Menace. They want it. Uh, on oh, they want it. Okay. Um. Yeah. I mean, I see him as a really. I mean, as a Nick pick. So. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, another prospect. I mean, very, very, uh, very like unlikely. Benedict Martin. I mean, potentially gone. Uh, he potentially be gone by eleven. But you never know. But I. I mean, from Arizona, I played good. I mean, in the tournament and the season. So, I mean, I see him, as a Nick, but. We'll see. The last and final prospects for the New York Knicks, uh, Marcus Williams and Center, 
it all depends what happened on uh, uh on about um uh Mitchell Robinson, but I mean, I don't see it getting a lone pick. I mean, a center, but I, I like last year we get uh Jericho Sims as a 15 overall pick as a like second to our last pick, but I mean that you know think that ends the video here. Uh, leave a comment, share, and uh, sh share it up, and follow all the, all the socials, and it's a he team.